Hi, this is Robert Bornstein from Robert's Tropical Paradise Garden, and today I want to show you the, the amaryllis I have planted throughout the garden. Now up north you grow amaryllis, and as you know it's a bulb, it's bigger than an onion, smaller than a rutabaga, and you usually plant it in the fall or winter to grow indoors for the holidays. But here in South Florida, we grow it as a landscape plant. And I just started with a few bulbs and over the years they've multiplied. So I have them growing in many places and I just love them. Here's a big clump, unbelievable. And some other ones over here. And what happens is after it's done blooming, it doesn't die out. The plant stays green and it stays green the entire year, building up enough energy to reproduce more flowers the following spring. So let me give you a quick tour of the garden so you can see all the other ones. Hi, this is Robert Bornstein from Robert's Tropical Paradise Garden, and today I want to show you the, the amaryllis I have planted throughout the garden. Now up north you grow amaryllis, and as you know it's a bulb, it's bigger than an onion, smaller than a rutabaga, and you usually plant it in the fall or winter to grow indoors for the holidays. But here in South Florida, we grow it as a landscape plant. And I just started with a few bulbs, and over the years they've multiplied, so I have them growing in many places, and I just love them. Here's a big clump, unbelievable. And some other ones over here. And what happens is after it's done blooming, it doesn't die out. The plant stays green, and it stays green the entire year, building up enough energy to reproduce more flowers the following spring. So let me give you a quick tour of the garden so you can see all the other ones.